Welcome to The Succulent Home with me, Melissa. You guys, I have a video of a cactus succulent boutique, if you will. Um, it's exactly what it is, so it's not if you will. It really is a boutique, and it's my future dream or passion one day. Hopefully, who knows, maybe I'll retire and I'll be like this little old mestiza lady who just runs a cacti succulent boutique. Who knows? Anyways, it's in San Diego and I took a trip there and I'm going to take you along so you can see because I recorded every little minute of it so you could be a part of it. So all of my friends who can't leave their houses, you're going to come along with me. But before I start and before you see it, let me show you what I ended up getting from there. I got some specimens that I've never had before in my collection and I'm happy to bring them to you today. First things first, let me show you this girl right here. Look at how pretty this is. It is a cacti that I've seen um, the succulent greenhouse have. This was $10 at that boutique and this is called um, a Rubri Spinus. Spinius? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna, you know what I'm saying? Right there, right there down below. You guys, I'm gonna write it all out for you so you can see exactly how you pronounce it and yeah, what it is. Okay, so it says it's a beautiful, usually solitary member of the hedgehog cactus family. Deep rose flowers to four inch in dynam diameter appear in late spring. So look at how pretty that is. Is that not cute? That is cute. <laughs> Love it. So I don't have that one and I'm glad that the next one is this one. It actually already bloomed when I brought it to the house, which I'm excited about. This one was actually $7.95. Everything, if you're in the San Diego area, everything in that cactus boutique is pretty much affordable. And there's very like, look at this, unique specimens that I don't get to see at my local Lowe's or some of the nurseries around here. So it's a four inch, and it doesn't say the name on here, it just says premium cactus. And I, I believe this is in the Euphorbia family, this isn't um, a cacti, but um, it did blossom a flower already. And if you know the specific name to this one, then please comment below. Also, I'm gonna be doing another giveaway. So if you watched that one video of the Colopa um, house plant humidifier giveaway, there's gonna be another giveaway. Maybe not this one, but. Okay, this one I have had, okay? This one is the little split rock. It has not bloomed yet, but isn't that so pretty? And um, I like it because it's a little bit bigger and I don't know why, I just, am gra I just gravitate to this one. This is called the Mimi Cry Plant technically, but it is a split rock and it'll split right here in the middle and it will blossom blooming a flower. Don't know what the color's gonna be. Let's see if this one says. It's a native to Africa, succulent pair of leaves form a clefted egg shape known as a bilobe. Um, and that's all it says. It doesn't say what color flower. So this is a beautiful cacti. Um, I first, I would think it was an euphorbia realistically. I, I mean, it's, it looks like an euphorbia to me, but it is saying it is a stenorius prune, prunosis. Y'all, y'all know with how I am with these. Okay. The names, it's going to be down below right there, but this actually grows. If I don't know if you could tell, but do you see that from like how I'm showing you? It grows like in a twirl of a, a twirl like. Yeah, it's beautiful. Look at the colors. It's a sage and mint green. I just love this. It is, it says is, it says the name, don't know it, but it says is a powdery gray columnar cactus that grows to 20 inch in height in time. Yeah, it's so beautiful. Last but not least, you guys, look at this bad girl. I love this one. It is the Mallow Cactus uh, Azurius, and it is a native to Brazil. I love that. 
and it forms solitary globular stems to eight inches in diameter. This plant is from a semi-tropical area of Brazil and will prefer temperatures no less than 50 Fahrenheit for best growth and appearance. So I could totally keep this in the succulent greenhouse um, and cacti here because it does get really hot and um, it would probably like the humidity and it probably will do well during winter. But look at how beautiful. It's almost like the barrel cactus, except this one has that powdery sage, bluish green tint. So and it even like looks like the, you know, the prickly things look almost like a lavender, dark gray color almost. Yeah, I kind of like that. I like that. Um, so I got the colored cactus. I got this one. Um, I got the little um, split rock, right? Kind of all in the color, the same color family. I got this one right here, which you guys are gonna help me with the name down below in the comment section. And then I got this one that grows into a spirally pillar. Um, over time, it will get 20 inches in height again. So keep watching so you can see this beautiful boutique and my future dream. Come on, come watch and comment below of what you think at the end too. What do you think about it?
the end of the weekend but i still wanna turn up yeah i still wanna turn up all i want is to go again but you ain't picking your phone up why are you messing my head up any night any day let me take you away all i need is just saying yeah 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 better nights better days when you're here with me babe Cause you're all that I crave, so I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me when I need you most We got love guaranteed and I have to know Say I made reservations Too many invitations And the last night was heavy, heavy. I need communication Tell me where's your location Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date Now it's closer to 11 And I ain't hearing nothing I just need to know that you're okay Take you away. All I need is you saying yeah, 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 yeah. Better nights, better days. When you're here with me, babe. Cause you're all I crave, so I wonder.
Tell me how good two people grow, rearrange and transpose, but it's always the same. I'm attracted to him. 